Urban Revolution Radio's Your Morning Show with your boy Nino and your man D. Hicks on Live 99, broadcasting live from the Evans Motor Studios, 1056 East Riverside Drive, home of the buy here, pay here option. All the great deals. Check them out this week on our Facebook page. And if you go down there and use promo code Nino, N-I-N-O, you'll get a $100 gift card upon purchase completion. Maybe even on that little 2010 Chevy Islanders that they had out there. You better get it because D had his eye on that. He was looking. <laughs> so we'll see who get it first. Got a great show lined up for you. We was talking about uh, Dwayne The Rock Johnson right. considering a presidential bid. I remember the memes was going around back in the day when Donald Trump was like losing for you know losing this election against Joe Biden and it was right. like a you know uh, uh the meme going around that who would you think would be the next celebrity president mm -hmm. it was like Dwayne the Rock Johnson Vin Diesel some other, you know what I mean going like right. that but I really think the rock could do it oh he does man cuz he's got a big follow you know what I mean if Donald Donald Trump is as much as you want to talk about whatever side of the pot Donald Trump is the ultimate person who showed that anybody can be president. Right. Political right, right. experience is no not required. <laughs> we, that's one thing Political experience is no longer required when it comes to running for president. So, I mean, Dwayne the Wright Johnson already has that to his advantage. Because that was his main complaint about what he said. He said that, uh, according to Yahoo Entertainment.com, Dwayne the Wright Johnson said he's done research on a potential presidential run, but admits, I don't know the first thing about politics. Politics, bro, don't require it. Education requires common sense. That's what the whole word politic means. It means right. to give and take, to exactly. talk back and forth. You know, right. but that's common what we sense. don't have politics going on in Washington right now. We right. got people taking stands and just, you know, obstructionist kind of on both sides. You know what I mean? There's no politic in no politics, exactly. There's going none back, there's no all. conversation. No, get, they like made a one down the, in Texas, man. Man, the dude them put the, the, the talking about the businesses they, can't ban. Yeah, they bid no man. You spend more time trying to kill people, dude. That's what I'm saying, man. But and he tried to use the argument about uh, you shouldn't force businesses to follow the mandate, but you forcing businesses not to follow the mandate. Right. You're doing the same You're thing. You're doing the same thing, If a thing, business right. wants to put that sign up on their store and saying mask required before you, that's their business to want to Because they they're want to paying taxes. They're doing what they're supposed to do. You know what I mean? That's what they want to take. They reach in their clientele. You know what I mean? But tell right. that they can't even put the sign up anymore or require, you know, they even their employees to get the shot anymore. Oh, come on now. So this is what I'm talking about. With when politics stop being politics, you know what I mean? the, the give and take stops going back and forth. That's when we get all this gridlock, obstructionist kind of. I'm just not gonna do this. You know what I mean? Right. Whatever you say, I'm gonna but, say you know, no and oppose it just because. Sad, sad thing about man, these are grown men. Yeah, and the grown and they get men, the I'm, more stubborn they get. I'm 52. But these are grown. Man, do you think a person like Donald men. Trump was going to change his mind halfway through office about any opinion he's ever had in life? 72 years old, he ain't changing his mind about nothing right now. Because he ain't got nobody to answer to. The older you get, the most stubborn a lot of people get. You ever visited to an old folks home and see how stubborn them old folks get when they don't have to answer to nobody thinking they can just berate the, the, the staff in there and all that kind of... Man... You read some stubborn, ornery old folks. Miss right. McConnell been in Congress like 50 years. 40 years. years. 40 <laughs> years. I mean, a friend of mine was talking about that the other day. She's from Kentucky, and she said that she can't believe that McConnell has been there 40 years. Man, Nancy Pelosi been in there 30-something, 40 years. You know what I mean? It's, they, there need uh, to be a term limit, bro. And dude, I've been an advocate of that right there, for real, for real. I, I think would the say three be eight for years. Congress, three, you eight get three years, limits eight in eight Congress. Years, same way if you ran for president, bro. No, the only reason why I say that. Because they get you two terms, homie. They get you two equal terms. Eight years should be the max limit because they get you two equal terms. The only reason why I say that is because you don't want the dramatic change in power every That's why you have to do it. I That's would say stagger that the way they stagger, like, you know, the House of Representative election. You, I'll give you three because you got to think how long it does, it takes to get stuff done. It can take eight years that's for why, a president. That's and why then if another president those, wants to follow, you still need that to I give him 12 years. No, I give 12. 12. 
No, that's how long years. I worked in my last. The reason why I say that's how right. long I worked in my last job. Okay. Twelve years. I'm gonna give you twelve years to establish your career. Do what you got to do, and mm -hmm. then you in and out, boom, boom. If you ain't done nothing in twelve years, right, you don't need to be there no more. You no, know what I mean? Twelve years. If you've been long working long. a job anywhere for twelve years or more, and you still making the same pay, ain't got a promotion, ain't made no achievements, no accomplishments, right. you know, ain't got the front parking spot in front of the building at least. You know what I mean? You need to quit. And I think right. back to you know when we're talking about. The not knowing anything about politics that Dwayne was talking about. That's mm -hmm. what kind of uh, do got Donald Trump elected in the first place. No, Alexander Ocasio Cortez. No. They, that that what they call Donald the outside. The outside. Yeah, Repeat Donald that Trump, again. They they were outsiders. They didn't they didn't have that previous in the trench political. Donald experience. did because he wanted to run for mayor in New York City at one time. But they, they didn't elect him. He right. has no so, political experience. But that, what I'm saying, though, they Donald, didn't elect him. Though, New York don't even consider, like Donald Trump. He right, they don't like him now. It's you open. Know, I mean, the Republican, they sold, they sold for Donald Trump. Whatever respect anybody, to me, whatever respect. And them, still send a soul for him. You know what I mean? So they, they pushing away some respectable Republicans. That's that, like, man, I don't want to be associated with that. Right. You know, sometimes it, you don't want to hire a plumber to drywall your house. See, you don't want to hire somebody that doesn't have the experience necessary to do an important job like that. True. You know what I mean? True. But sometimes, you, you know, like going to the barber college, you get somebody a chance, you know what I mean? You know, because he's got advisors around there. Maybe you need that clean slate of the, you know, you know, no obstructive view, no political lean, and nobody really to affiliate you to as the head. You know what I mean? Because you got all these dragons and snakes underneath them trying to fight for what they want and snitching and snitch. So you got to have somebody in the middle. That's what the president's supposed to be in the vice president. There's supposed to be right. somebody in the middle that can bring these guys to because we've never had an independent. I don't think we've ever had, an, had independent an independent president. president. Even Joe, I mean, no, uh, uh, Mayor, no, Bernie Sanders. They keep hating on Bernie, man. He Bernie had to attach dude. himself to the Democratic Party just to get on the just ticket. Just to get on the ticket, and that's ridiculous. You know, and maybe we need to restructure all that kind of stuff. You know what I mean? Maybe you shouldn't be just be anybody can run. If you got enough, you know, enough publicity and enough resources to get your campaign out there, you should be able to be on the ticket. I agree with you. You know, you still, I still agree with the 35 years of age, natural born citizen, no felonies, all kind of, you know what I mean? That kind of stuff. Those, stuff, I still believe those requirements for the president should still be in place. But I also do think it should be in place. So that makes no sense well. then. Why? Because Trump was uh, impeached twice. They waited to get convicted. So. Right. It, it, so that's only in one side of it. You know what I mean? That's, you know, that was the dog and pony show. Yeah, you know what I mean? You know, show. same way they did with Bill Clinton. You know what I mean? That was just the dog and pony show just to say, oh, we do, we do stomp it. Because they knew they was losing. You know Bill what I mean? They knew they couldn't do Bill nothing about it. Teach. You know what I mean? Like, I it was looking them dead in their eyeballs like, I did not have sexual relations with them. <laughs> <laughs> Lying dead in people's faces. Because they knew they couldn't Bill, touch them. Bill, Bill, they Bill. They couldn't touch them. You know if what I mean? If you so, listen to Bill Clinton, he had relations with them. <laughs> we are. <laughs> He did. <laughs> Monica about to make it. She got a new talk show coming I know, out. I can't wait. Stuff. I'm going to check it out. Yeah. So, I think Dwayne The Rock Johnson could do it, though. If he really put his mind to it within the next two years, you, it really I don't. Think he made, I think he may make a determination depending on who's on the ticket. I think he could, I think he could run for some political. I don't think but, he should start with president, though. I think he should Trump go like started with President Hale. You with know what I mean? But that's he caught the Republican Party and you know with you know with their pants down by the balls. No, no, he bought he did because the they didn't have any really. He they didn't have anybody that, that could stand that old up. School hate racist stuff to the White and House. That's what I'm saying. But the way he delivered, he he couldn't say things the way no other Republican could say the things he said the way he said it because they had you like constituents. Grab, you like grab by right. the, they had constituents to answer to if they right. lost it. They had to go back to their hometown. Trump don't have to go back to anybody to answer. New, New York don't even like him, his own hometown. Florida trying to kick him out, you know what I mean? But he was elected because he was, you know, hawking Hillary Clinton all over on the he was he was the aggressor. For the, he was giving people the voice that they felt they that they had. was missing. No, they had. And you can say no, they, they never had. had it. They never had it. Oh yeah. They, no, 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 no. They never had it. 
Come on now, it's been put- unless you're looking back, you know, if you're going back to the forties. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Of that nature, it, they had it they before. Had they it. wanted it to be able to they say anything, it. to call you they boy, to call you in word, right, to call had you whatever, well, with with impunity. Trust me, it, it, right? They had it, and but they lost. We it. got politically super no, correct. We never really did. Yeah, we super politically correct right now, dude. No, we're not. Yeah, you don't really. No, we just talking about how you can't say nothing to hurt but, nobody feelings. Right, nowadays. but if we were really well, we did though. But what I'm saying, though, but we were really truly politically correct. We never had Trump in that office. No, Trump. That's what I'm saying. Trump was that break the political correctness. Okay, thing. yeah, I misunderstood. Yeah, you yeah. Are he was that. We don't want. We want to be able to call people what we want to call them. We don't like these. We don't like that. It's American. Yeah. You know what I mean? When you ask that question, people say, "How did Hitler do it?" That's how Hitler did it. He told the people exactly what they wanted to say when they needed to hear it. He God, gave them a he, voice. He gave them that. You, I will say what you felt like you but haven't been able to say. I don't want to say. sound so bad, though, but he gave white America a voice that they lost. That's my point. The, the, that 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 outside rule, racist, cool. To be, I mean, how you going up into the Capitol with a Confederate flag? Right. Y'all lost. How you go? That's an enemy flag. You're right. If they really knew <laughs> what it was, they really knew the meaning behind it. You can't fly a swastika flag in Germany. You know where that's against federal law because the Nazis lost. You can't right. do that. They tried to overthrow the government. Right. They took it over. They say, okay, no more. We ain't doing that no more. So how is it legal? Because, I mean, every state has their own flag. So you mm -hmm. can't say it's just culture. Every state has a flag that doesn't have to incorporate that. Hell, that I wish I knew what culture I was. Simple there. You hear me? Huh? I wish I knew what culture I was. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? So I think Dwayne Johnson sure. could do it. I don't think After he should start with uh I don't think he should start presidential. I think he should start maybe like Schwarzenegger level governor, maybe a mayor, or something like that. Governor you know be I mean? cool. Governor Johnson. Governor be cool. You know. And then give what? that if you're really looking for experience, governor be cool. Yeah, give him it's just to one thing. That that's what Barack did. Obama did. He was yeah. the youngest senator when he got elected yes, he to was. the Senate, did that one couple yes, of terms, and then went straight to president. Get your chops wet, you know what I mean? Learn some people, get some names in, blah, blah, mm -hmm. blah, 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 and then you could try. So I could see Dwayne 2028. If he runs president, if he do governor 2024, but 2026. He's going to run as an independent if he's going to make a difference. Because both parties are corrupt right now. Yeah, I, uh, you know, I, I prefer the Republican. independent myself. You know what I mean? So but if like I'm going to run, if I had that type of power, I run strictly as an independent. Yeah, you know, but that would be adding on to the risk as well. Because, you know, normally independents lean more Democratic. They like the far left of the Democratic You're Party right, to the point where they chop it off. You know what I mean? But I do... the. Founding fathers say that the, the, it's not supposed to be two political parties anyway. If you really do your research, George Washington, well, Germany, Thomas Jefferson, I mean, uh, all that. England's got about three of them, boy. They be yelling. That's, that. And that was, that's what I'm talking about. When those our so-called founding fathers came, they were against that political party. So right. that's what was already going on over where they just left from. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So True. I can see Dwayne Johnson do it. Start off as a mayor, maybe governor, maybe 2020. Not mayor, bro. Governor. Man, nah, man, you, you think you're no, too big for man? man. Too, too big, big for man. For mayor, man. Uh, what if, like, man, New York? Is he from New York? Where is he from? I don't know what city he's from, but, you know, depending on what city he's from. Right. If, right, if he right. could get mayor of New York, you know what I mean? I don't know if he's from New York. A mayor of Los Angeles or something like that? Run that. Right. Run you know, that. a senator or something like Senator Johnson. Right. That'd be cool, too. <laughs> you know, so let us know. Do you think uh, Dwayne the Rock Johnson has a potential political career? And so, what level do you think he should start at? President? Mayor, Governor, let us know, 812-303-5018 or on our Facebook page, facebook.com slash live 999 WJCB.